will, I will end the program now to world premiere. <laughs> um, when they actually accepted to, to play this concert, um, they were, uh, one was barely finished and the other one was still in progress. So not only I had to finish them as I put them in the program, um, but I also had to learn them. <laughs> and um, my toilet suite, yes, you heard it correctly, uh, I, I toilet suite is my office 21. Just to make a comparison, um, Beethoven wrote his first symphony, office 21. Uh, Chopin wrote his second concerto, uh, the F minor concerto, office 21, and Mendelssohn wrote the um, Midsummer Night Dream, office 21. So I only write for the suite. <laughs> I, I wanted to write something that would convey a universal message. <laughs> and, and often we pick our brain too much thinking what could be universal if mythology would be good enough or uh, some uh, life event that nobody can ever forget. Well, I wanted to do something more, uh, more basic. Uh, <laughs> um, and again, I like humor in music and uh, I think this is probably I'm the only composer that has ever written something. And talking about dedication, it was hard to find a dedicated team. <laughs> <laughs> um, it, it took me a while. I had to tap on all my friends and say, hey, would you like me to dedicate you a toilet seat? <laughs> Eventually, I found one. And is a very kind lady, a pianist, an Italian pianist, a composer, that she understands uh, the, the necessity of finding somebody to whom I don't want to, see, to say to be inspired by to write this work. <laughs> um, so here is the first world premiere of Toilet Suite. <laughs>